Hey guys, welcome to a brand new video and today I'll be testing and reviewing the Adidas X 15.1. Back in June, Adidas decided to ditch their four popular silo which were the Predators F50 11 Pro and the Nitro Charge. They felt the time was right to change football because after a lot of time researching and analysing, Adidas found out there are only two types of players, one who causes chaos and one who is a playmaker. Today I'll be looking closely at the X15.1 which are the new speed wheel by Adidas and the replacement for the F50. Let's see if it's good or any better. Hope you enjoy the video. First of all the design of the Adidas X. To be honest I wasn't so keen on the launch colorway and the design at first. For me it looked too bold but the blackout version of the X looks grey in my opinion. The colorway is pretty much black out, but has the small dots in the X cage, X branding on the tongue, the sole play features, the new X class dot configuration, which I'll be talking about in detail later on, and the sole play is colored black, but mostly grey, and overall it's a great looking boot. Comfort and fit is really really good, while testing them out I didn't perceive any blisters or discomfort within the boot. With the help of this tech fit color it kind of felt like I've been wearing these boots for years. The tech fit does a great job of wrapping around your ankles and it makes you feel like the boot is part of you. The X skin is soft and requires no breaking time. However, the sole play requires 2-3 to three training sessions to break in fully. Also, something I experienced with the X is that it wasn't too wide or too narrow for my feet. Which I was surprised about because the F50 were too narrow for me. And I didn't like the F50 in terms of comfort and fit. To get the best fit from these boots, I recommend staying true to size because you will get that perfect fit as the X skin will mold nicely after a few sessions. Also, the X cage is present on the mid foot to give you a good lockdown effect. Touching fit with the ball is excellent. The X skin is soft and there are no other distractions around the upper. The sole play features Adidas's new x class dot configuration, which allows unpredictable moves and unbeatable acceleration. And I really like the sole play because it's made for both firm ground and artificial ground surface, and the response is really well. Protection and the durability are the two things that disappointed me about these boots. Since the X skin is super soft, if you get stood on, it will hurt a lot. Also, I've been testing these for around 2 weeks now and I'm starting to spot some problems regarding durability. But it should last you a season at least. Overall, it's a great boot and I'd recommend these to any player who's a game changer and likes to take a bit of risk. I think Adidas made a great decision replacing these for their 50 as the comfort is huge thanks to this the color. Although durability isn't quite good as I'd hoped for, but at the end of the day I'm playing football not dancing around in them. They retail price around 200 euro and I think it's worth every bit. Would I buy another pair? I absolutely would as I can safely say these are the best boots I've tested up to this day. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.